Hey, what's going on guys, Nate the Great coming at you back again for another book review. Today's book, Creating Money, Attracting Abundance, okay, really amazing read. I actually just finished this, it took me about, let's say a week and a half, going on two weeks. Really, really great read, especially if you're looking to not just make more money, but understand the process of what making money actually consists of, right? Because at the end of the day, money is energy. And there's so many famous quotes and things out there. When you think about money as energy, really think about that. Money is energy. Money is energy. Money is energy. So wait, you're telling me if I put energy into something that I love, I can make money with that, right? You absolutely can. Okay, and this book goes over this significantly. So I read the back a little bit. Creating Money, an Orin slash Dobbin book. It's the international bestseller with a new foreword by Mark Allen. This step-by-step -step guide to creating money in abundance was given to Sananya and Duane by their guides, Oren and Debin. These wise and general spirit teachers have successfully helped thousands to manifest prosperity and create their life's work using the simple processes contained in this book. You can see immediate results in your life when you learn to follow the spiritual laws of money and abundance, develop unlimited thinking, listen to your inner guidance, Use advanced manifesting technique, techniques, creating your life's work, transforming your beliefs, magnetizing and drawing to you what you want. Abundance is your natural state. As you use the information in this book, you will learn how to let money flow readily into your life while doing what you love. These easy to learn techniques, positive affirmations and exercises will help you create rapid changes in your prosperity and lead you to mastery over your life. You do not have to work hard to have abundance. You can learn to work with your energy to create what you want. Begin today to strengthen your link to the unlimited abundance of the universe. So absolutely, this is a very spiritual, universal, money-like kind of book. Really, really great. So I'll just go over some of the contents with you guys. Um, you know, something I like about this book is it has actual exercises at the end of every single section, which is super, super cool. Um, so yeah, section one is on creating money. You know, you are the source, becoming abundant, discovering what you want, and magnetizing what you want. Section two is on developing mastery, following your inner guidance, allowing success, transforming your beliefs, letting money flow, coming out of survival, trusting in miracles. Section three is on creating your life's work. That consists of you can do what you love, discovering your life's work, you have what it takes, Believing in yourself, trusting the flow, moving to your higher path. Section four is on having money, honoring your value and worth, joy and appreciation, giving and receiving, clarity and harmony, having money, savings, affirming your abundance. And then it goes over some of your principles. So again, it doesn't matter what area you're at. Like if you don't have any money at all, like if you're broke, if you, you know, make a decent amount of money and you have a bunch saved up, or, you know, if you have a ton of money, and you just, you just don't know what to do. Right, like you're doing well, you're paying the bills and you have so much just wealth, okay? So I, I love how this isn't just a book about what it's like to go from zero to, to one, right? Peter Thiel, but um, I love how this isn't just a book about investing or where to actually just put your money. Like this is an all-in-one book that is absolutely magnificent for the average reader and for somebody that might read thousands of books or might this might be your first book, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip to one page as I normally do in this book. Some, something I'm called to that I'm, I'm pulled towards. And the page that I'm going to flip to is exactly what it is that, you know, you might need to hear or get reminded of based off of the energy frequency. So I'm going to feel for it. Some, something's telling me to pull towards the back of the book, kind of. Wow. Okay. Got you. So I'm going to read. It's actually a play sheet. That's funny. It's a play sheet. It's actually one of the exercises. So you can do this, um, you know, after you listen to this. So believing in yourself. Imagine that it is 10 years from today. Okay. So I'm 23 now. I'd be 33. You've given yourself permission to be all you can be. You have believed in yourself. You've taken the appropriate steps to follow your higher path. How do you feel about yourself in your life? Make up a fantasy about the success of your last 10 years. Now imagine the same 10 year period. You did not give yourself permission to follow your own path. You did not believe in yourself. How do you feel about your life? 
Three, which path will you choose? Decide now. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty much like one of the play sheets. So, again, think about the things that, if everything could happen to you and for you with what it is that you want to do, how would your life look like? And then if things didn't quite go the way that you planned, and you doubted yourself, you had fear, you just weren't necessarily in the correct vibration, you know, the results, of course, are going to be accordingly on, on how you are as a person. Uh, so in this chapter, Believing in Yourself, I'm going to read out like it gives a lot of affirmation statements. OK, so I'm going to read the ones in this chapter and you, you can totally just write these down as well. I actually got to the point where I put like on my walls and stuff throughout my house, just different affirmations that I say every single day. Or I might not necessarily say them, but for example, like if I ever got to go to the refrigerator, it has on there that health is wealth, you know? So it's like every time I'm like, oh, well, health is wealth. So I'm not going to, you know, pack a, you know, doggone McDonald's tray in there, you know? <laughs> so, so, okay, I'm going to go through these affirmations quick and then well, we'll be done with this one. So I give myself permission to be all I can be. Okay. I give myself permission all that I can be. I commit to my path. I choose aliveness and growth. I follow my heart. I can have what I want. I invite and allow good to come into my life. So, yeah, I'll, I'll read a couple more for you here. I flow with the current. I know that everything happens for my higher good. I am alert to my opportunities and I use them well. I release anything that is not for my higher good and ask it to release me. I love and honor everything I create. The last one is I let go easily, trusting that nothing leaves my life unless something better is coming. Again, ladies and gentlemen, over a half a million copies of this book have been sold. Creating money, attracting abundance. Highly, highly recommend this. Doesn't matter where you're at financially, where you're at in your career. Doesn't matter if you're at the top of the top, the bottom of the bottom. This is a great book for anybody. So I hope you enjoyed this. Again, feel free to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you aren't already. I appreciate your support so much. Thank you. Also, check out the Roots of Success podcast on my YouTube channel, interviewing some very highly successful, incredible, deeply spirited, and, 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 and prosperous souls, to say the least. So thank you so much for staying tuned. I appreciate you.